historically, the ministries of United Methodist Men and Scouting have been uh, ordered by the Book of James. We use the Book of James as the motto of the ministry we have. So in James 1, 22 to 24, this is the new Revised Standard Version of it, be doers of the word and not hearers only who deceive themselves. For if you are a hearer of the word and not a doer, they are like those who look at themselves in a mirror and they look at themselves and on going away immediately forget what they're like. Hmm. Not much room for air there for interpretation. Are we deceiving ourselves? Are we misleading ourselves? So what would what John Wesley say to guide us into active discipleship? Well, Wesley gave us three simple rules. Uh, the late wonderful Bishop Job uh, uh, put those in a small book for us. It's a great text if you haven't read it. But those rules are simple do no harm, do good, stay in love with God by practicing the ordinances of God. Important practices, but to what end? Prayer obviously is important. Studying or searching the scriptures is a wonderful practice. Attending church, hearing great sermons, being filled and fed, but for what? Wesley didn't say, uh, because you might do harm, don't do anything. Uh, he, he wants to make sure that you don't do harm. So in your actions that you're doing, just make sure you're not harming anyone. Doing good does not mean just have wonderful thoughts about stuff. It's about action. So Wesley and James both challenge us to have an active doing faith, actions that bring hope and healing. What we've learned and the skills that we've obtained are be placed into practice, not to be, you know, put in a box, but to be put into practice.